Hey everybody, this is El Hybrid, and welcome back to Below Average Gaming as we're playing Game of Thrones Episode 1, Part 2. Welcome back. So now we're in Iron Wrath. Yeah. <laughs> It's Garrett! It's me! <laughs> Castellan! Tell his nephew survived! It's me. Garrett! I was too late. They were already dead. Bring the maester! Meet us in the Great Hall! Quickly! We're meeting in the Great Hall. Two White Hill soldiers and a Bolton. They killed my family. And for what? For a sword. My sister, <laughs> she. She was only eight years old. Damn, that sucks. This never would have happened with the Starks in power. It's. Unimaginable. Unacceptable. Unacceptable. You have, you have my, my condolences. condolences. Thank you, Mister. Mm. Blade cut deep, but I should be able to save your leg. Oh my god, really, dude? Your justice was swift. Some will call it vengeance. No doubt the White Hills will claim it was murder. It was your family. I can't say I would have done any different It was justice. It was justice. They got what they deserved. They did indeed. You can't let the Whitehills just walk all over us. These maggots ought to help prevent infection. Hold the wound open for me, would you? Jesus, bro, really? Dark days, I fear. To lose the lord of the house and the eldest son through such a despicable act of treachery and betrayal. Greater houses than ours have fallen in times such as this. The late Lord Forrester was a good man. And poor Roderick. A serious man, but he would have made a good lord. Roderick and Lord Forrester. We can avenge them. And attack House Frey. Now is the time to find allies and I wonder enemies. if, like, the, the background is supposed to look Lord like that. It's just... now, although he is young and altogether My shit's to not lead. good quality. <laughs> right. Uh, this might hurt a bit. Hold this for me, will you? I understand from your uncle that Lord Forrester saved your life. He did. Rather odd, though, that he chose to save you, his squire, and not his son, Roderick. Not that Roderick couldn't handle himself. He was as good with a sword as any man I've seen. It's unfortunate the Citadel doesn't train maesters in the art of warcraft. I imagine I'd be pretty good with a sword. Sorry, sometimes my curiosity gets the better of me. Lady Forrester will be here any moment now. I'd like you to walk for me first. To see if you can put any weight on that leg. Go on. Don't stop now. It's better to let the blood circulate. <sighs> let the blood circulate. I want to look at the chair. The Ironwood Grove.
Mira. Still in King's Landing, I suppose. Although, I wonder if they'll bring her home. Talia and Ethan. I suppose Lord Ethan now. Asher. Exiled to Essos, unfortunately. Ryan. Never easy being the fourth born son. Lord Forrester. It was an honor to squire for him. Gregor the Good. Lady Forrester. She kind of looks like Cat and Spine to me. Treated me like I was a forester myself. Roderick. He was our best warrior by far. Hmm. You seem to be favoring it. Always sad to see a warrior lose a leg. I, I'm fine, Mr. Tengren. Look. I'll show you. I'm okay. I'm okay. Don't take my leg. Maggot. <laughs> I'm gonna touch him. <laughs> Rather cute little creatures, aren't they? I guess. Come on, man, just bandage me up and let's get this going on. Healing herbs. This might help. Does your leg feel weak? Nope. Feels no. good. I just wanted to ask you. Who is the new lord of House Forest? Why, Ethan, of course. At the Citadel. I swore an oath to serve whichever noble house I was assigned. Advising the late Lord Forrester was an honor. Advising Ethan, his third-born son, is challenging. There's still so much he has to learn, that the very fate and future of this house rests in his hands. Which is rather frightening when you think about it. What will happen to me now? Excellent question. Hmm. Under normal circumstances, you could join Sir Roiland and his men. Although, given the circumstances of your circumstances, it becomes a bit tricky, doesn't it? I suppose it will be for Lord Ethan to decide. Lord Forrester promoted me. At the Twins, I, I'm no longer a squire, if that matters. It might, I suppose. But I'll defer to Lord Ethan on this. Why do the White Hills hate the Foresters? I think it's safe to say the feeling is mutual. There's been enmity between the two houses for as long as anyone can remember. I don't doubt someone killed someone, which led to more killings of someone's, and then, well, here we are. Someone's killed someone's. The White Hills want Forester Ironwood. Ah, they'd take it all if we'd let them, especially now with the Boltons in power and proceed to clear-cut every last inch of it until there's nothing left. Just as they've done before. Can I see Ethan? Is he here? He is. But I'm afraid he's indisposed at the moment. He prefers not to be disturbed while practicing his loot. His loot? Can I go now? I believe your leg will be fine. Only time will tell, but... Lady Forrester. Welcome home, Garrett. We're all relieved to know you survived. She looks like Captain Star Lady. Talia asked to see you. Garrett, I heard what happened. Is it true? She likes you. Your she family... likes me. I'm so sorry. 
Ato. Off to bed now. Hurry on. <laughs> None of that mushy mushy stuff here, you will get to bed. Garrett was just telling me how valiantly Lord Forrester fought to the end, even when all was lost. I'm sure Lady Forrester would like to know. Whatever you can recall. He loved his family, my lady. He was very proud of Roderick. Yet he was unable to save him. You were with Roderick, no? I'm sure it was chaos and confusion. But if you can remember anything, I'm sure Lady Forrester would like to know. Rob Stark named him to lead the van for the march on Casterly Rock. A fitting tribute, no doubt. He was House Forrester's best. This has been so incredibly difficult for us, especially the children. But I was told. I was told you were the last to see my husband alive. Yes, my lady. I know it may be difficult to remember, but if I may ask, was there anything he said? Any last words before he passed? If you can remember. It would mean so much to the family. He mentioned something about the North Grove. The North Grove? What of it? He said, the North Grove must never be lost. The North Grove? Interesting. I see. Well, wasn't I supposed to say that? You have the Forester's sword. Ethan should have it, now that he is Lord. Lord Forrester asked me to return it to the house. He said this is where it belongs. With his family. Thank you, Garrett. Of course, my lady. It demands a response. It's too dangerous, especially now. What the hell? I'll be sure it's given to Ethan. Duncan. This was our land. They were our people. Your family. That's the dude that was supposed to tell that shit to. Fuck, I missed that. time to provoke the White Hills. Not with Ramsay Snow coming to see us bend the knee. The hell with Ramsay Snow, that bastard. Garrett, you understand what this means. You killed a Bolton, and Ramsay Snow will want his retribution. Fuck Ramsay Snow. They're the ones who should be demanding retribution. This happened on Forrester land. They killed my family. And they'll pay for what they've done. That much, I promise. But now is not the time for vengeance. It's not now. When? We have to be smart. Ramsay Snow will be here within the week. And what would you have us do? Nothing. I would have us use our heads while they're still attached to our shoulders. Garrett has lost as much as anyone else within these walls. Maybe you can talk some sense into your uncle. Garrett suffered enough already. You asked too much of him. He deserves to be heard. My uncle's right. We need to be smart. Smart. Eddard Stark was smart. And look where that got him. So, what's to be done? Uh, don't lose the North Curve. I don't fuck. I didn't know that wasn't my uncle. I didn't I just a revealed the message. The sword. He knows nothing of how to lead men. He is the lord of this house, and he needs our help. It's bad enough the Boltons would have us bend the knee and swear fealty. But now, this. I'll accuse you of murder, and us of protecting you. The boy was just defending himself. I'm not faulting him for what he did. It wasn't murder. It was justice. Not in their eyes. It's just the excuse Ramsay Snow would need to put us to the torch and kill us all. I'd like to see them try. I'm afraid it's a risk we cannot take, which is why you cannot stay. You cannot stay, stay. Duncan, the boy has suffered enough. But where would I go? Oh, I missed up. That's not what I want. beyond the reach of even House Bolton. What, fucking the war? You're sending him to the war? The boy's done nothing wrong! Not in the eyes of the Boltons. That's not what I wanted to. I'm afraid it's the only solution. Uncle, my place is here. Who will defend the house? He said we need men who can fight. There'd be nothing we could do to protect you. To stay would bring destruction upon us all. I know that's not what you want, what you want. I know it's difficult to understand. But you must think of the house. I know it doesn't uh, seem I stayed fair. quiet. Damn it, this what's fast. best. That settles it, settles it then. 
You can have my horse, and I'll see you have plenty of food. But we haven't much time. The White Hills will come looking for you. Dun dun dun! What's gonna go down? What is gonna go down? Word up to me. I'd gladly drive a sword through Lord Whitehill's heart and give him a chance. I would. If God's willing, someday I will. But now, I have House Forrester to consider first. I know you want to stay, but Lord Forrester would be proud that you're putting the interests of the house ahead of your own. Many of Lord Forrester's best men have volunteered for the war. His own great uncle was a ranger with the Night's Watch. He promoted me. At the Twins. We were to ride in the van to Casterly Rock and, and I at Roderick's side, but... It was well deserved, Garrett. You worked hard and served your lord with honour. I've been waiting for the right moment to tell you. Uh, I totally fucked up and revealed that shit. What? What is it? Lord Forrester asked me to give you a message. He said... The North Grove can never be lost. Sorry. You caught me by surprise. It's not often discussed, if ever. Where is the North Grove? That, I cannot say. Not yet, at least. Most don't even know it exists. They think it's just I totally a made fucked up. Wildlands and Damn. Forms, and it's better kept that way. Damn it, I totally you fucked told up. Anyone else, have you? I accidentally did, man. This is important, Garrett. I told Lady Forrester. The Maester Ortengren overheard. I appreciate your honesty. But Lord Forrester's message was not meant for their ears. I'll speak with Lady Forrester. And I'll deal with the Maester. He's the last person I would trust with this information. I Which would too, but I thought you were him. Forward, this must be our secret. Soon, I may need your help. What? I can't say anything more just yet. Just know the North Grove may very well be vital to the future of this house. But don't breathe a word of it to anyone at the wall. Become a ranger if you can. It will help. <laughs> Am I gonna get to meet Jon Snow? <laughs> Remember, you represent House Forrester. Your actions at the wall will reflect the honor and dignity of the house. I'll make you proud. You already have. Take your necklace, Talia. Be, be safe. Alright guys, I think we're going to end it right here for this time and I'll catch you guys next time.